Brian, tell me, uh, how do you spell your last name? Where? Okay, tell me a little bit about... Okay, the group that you see assembled behind me, which are our chances, hands up, don't shoot. Everybody's aware of what's going on in Ferguson right now in St. Louis, but it has affected us all and all our communities. And so for me, myself, uh, when I saw the incident, the tragedy that happened in Ferguson, uh, I had to ask myself, well, what am I going to do? What am I going to do about this? And for me, myself, it's too many African American men that are being shot dead in the street um, through police brutality. Uh, some of the violence is coming from myself, my own communities. But we're talking about particularly those individuals who have been charged with an oath to protect and serve uh, our communities and, and ourselves. And so uh, we just want to say we are drawing a line here in the sand right now saying that we will no longer tolerate our children, who, who's only 18 years old, hands up, unarmed, on his way to college, and he's running from the police. He's shot seven times and his body lays in the streets. I'm here, we here, we are here to get this today as a community, a local Atlanta community, to say the Ferguson, the white brown family, to say we love them, we're here for them in their time of bereavement, but we're also gonna say to our city, Atlanta, that hey, we're gonna stand up, we're gonna stand up for injustice. But the injustice anywhere is a threat to justice everywhere. What do you think the biggest thing um, about, even though you have a small group here and there was a group a couple days ago that was, that was you know, meeting and, 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 and you know, doing the same thing? First of all, I would like to say that that question is this. If there are small protests peacefully, such as ours, assembled together and protesting and getting the message out, then as far as I'm concerned, I'm happy that everybody is putting, uh, pitching in and, and giving their hand and making their voices be heard. So it's not necessarily that we need to have 5,000 people down here. It's not necessarily to have 500 people down there. As long as two or three people are here and getting out the message that there's an injustice this time, that uh, our, our police departments around the country need to stop looking at African American young men as threats, uh, uh, assuming that they're criminals, instead of assuming that, hey, this is just a human being. Look, we have to draw the line in that. So I'm excited that, that the message is finally getting out. I'm excited that protests are taking uh, a place across the country. And I'm excited. I want this movement to continue. But I hope it opens the door to a larger conversation with the entire community that at the end of the day, you know, regardless of me being black, regardless of you being white, that we're all one people, we're all human beings, and that we need to look after one another better than this. Anybody, whether it's here in Atlanta, whether it's down in St. Louis, whether it's in California, whether it's in New York, because it's taking place all across the country, we all need to remember that the, the message is uh, nonviolence, peaceful protest, and, and let your voice be heard that way. And that's going to have a better reflection on our community, and it's going to be make more more uh, uh, groups empathetic to our cause and willing to come in and build better, broader coalitions together that we can face this problem. Good job, man. You Thank you. Really good job. It's you know, in Ferguson, St. Louis, 18-year-old African American male shot, hands up, running away, hit seven times, and laid died dead in the street, shot down dead in the street. His body laid in the street for hours. Didn't even let his family get there. Uh, the Trayvon Martins of the world, you know. And so I said to myself, when I saw that on TV, I said, it, particularly just as an African American male myself, well, what, I, what am I doing? What am I gonna do about this right now? You know, we have to get upset about this stuff and draw a line in our communities with this. Because when they see us hit the streets, you a threat. You a criminal. You, you, you a drug dealer, or you a drug addict, you, you, you one of those things, you know, so we have the right to exist as just people, you know, we have the right to pursue our dreams, our aspirations, to go to college, that young man was on his way to college, man, three days away, he had just made it out on his way to college and it's gone, and so it's up to us, such as your sisters, such as yourselves, who have come out, brothers, such as yourself, my brother, who showed out, and it's just a few of us. But let me tell you something, all movements start small, all of them. And, and right now, right now, right now this minute, in Ferguson, they are, they are doing the same thing. They got Al Sharpton down there, they got the NAACP, but we right here in Atlanta doing our part because we want to send a message to the Atlanta Police Department as well that we're not going to have that down here. And we want to let St. Louis and the Mike Brown family know that we support them in their moment of, of bereavement right now. 
somebody lost a, a child, man. She lost her baby boy. You understand? A father lost a son. You know, that it's much more personal than that. And so, we, and we lost a member of our community. And so we here right now, and I'm glad y'all here with us to support this cause. You're doing a great thing. I'm sure God has ordained and sanctioned this thing. And so right now, for a few minutes, we're going to go hands up, All day. guns down. You know, we have a right to live. We have a right to assemble ourselves. And when, when there is an injustice, do your thing. Tell somebody. Tell your friend. Tell a friend's friend about what's going on. And that's how the movement starts, man. And I appreciate every single one of y'all. So with that said, hands up! Hey! <laughs> hands up! Don't shoot! <laughs>